Well, Jaden, first of all, I just want to say congratulations to you for the season that you've had to this point. Uh, you have a winning record now. Um, as a teammate to these other guys, you've been a mentor and you've been a leader. That's why you were named a team captain. I'm proud of you for that accomplishment. I'm proud of the fact of, that you're always eager, eager to learn, uh, always wanting to get better. I'm also proud of the way you root for your other teammates and are very, very um, you know, emotionally in, invested in, in whether they win or lose. And for the rest of the season, Jaden, uh, I'm looking forward to uh, seeing you place high at conference, maybe even being a conference champion. Um, and my hopes are that we get you through sectionals and see if you can make a splash at districts. Congratulations, Jaden, on a great senior season. I wrestled um, since about seventh grade. There was a couple off years in between there just due to not having some of the, like a coach at one point. Uh, so yeah, I did wrestle. I wrestled for about three years total. I like the fact that we can go out there and work hard and, you know, be, I, I love the team. I love just the guys that I'm around. It's just, it, it's hard to explain in a sentence because the experience is just so like above what I can put into words for you. I don't, honestly, I don't think there's anything I could compare it to. I, like I usually visualize myself from like a third person perspective, like I'm, I'm, zo I'm zoomed out on the match that I'm in and I'm thinking about all the different moves I'm hitting, what uh, I'm going to do if the kid decides to do A, B, and C. Um, I, like to, I like to listen to some loud hype music and uh, bounce around, get my blood uh, pumping. Uh, just uh, bounce around and get ready for the match and just think of envision myself winning envision the match how it's going to go what my process is what I'm going to do out there when when I get on the mat yeah I'm still thinking about it I'm probably going to go uh, uh, towards something medical uh, I, I love working with kids I think it's uh, uh, there's just there's something special about working with uh, young people it's just like I like that environment around younger kids Jaden, as a wrestler, to me means great guy. He helps us out, and I hope that he goes on to do great things as a wrestler and as a human. He sets a good example for the lower classmen on what the future for them is going to look like. I love how Jaden, as a teammate, he's always there to lighten the mood, and he's always there to pick you up when you're down. And he's always willing to uh, set the example and give examples if you don't understand. He's always encouraging. He's always there for you if you need him. If you lose, he's always there to bring you up. And if you win, he's always there to congratulate, be the first to congratulate you and pat you on the back. He's kind of like a extra mentor. And if you're struggling with like when it moves and stuff, he comes around and helps you. Well, I just want to say congratulations to you, Luke, on a great senior season. As far as the teammate that you've been, to the other guys in the room. You've been a leader and a mentor. I'm very, very proud of the way that you wrestle with limited experience. Um, and as far as your season goes forward, I look forward to you being a conference champion, which I think is definitely within your realm. I look forward to you competing for a sectional championship. And I certainly hope uh, that you make a splash at districts. Congratulations, Luke, on a great senior season. Oh, I really enjoy, what I really enjoy about wrestling, honestly, is, um, the hard work it's it's really it's really fun to go out there go on a mat and not know anything about a person but going out there and putting everything you got into the sport that you practice for and just beating the kid up I mean I've been a part of all different types of um, all different types of teams soccer football you know track and I would say wrestling it's just it's a different type of atmosphere most people to prepare themselves before a game they like to listen to some loud music or anything like that or just get angry with me it's, it's more about being like I don't know patient with myself and with my thoughts and my process and what I like to do is I actually have someone punch me in, <laughs> in like my chest <clears throat> right before I, right before I go out there and then I go out there Give myself a couple slaps before I start wrestling, get my blood stream going, go out there and wrestle it up. Luke means a lot to us for this season. To me, Luke is a perfect example of a hard worker. He tries his best in everything he does and he's always there to encourage us when we may be down. And I just wanna say thank you to Luke for being an amazing teammate and an amazing example to all of us. Uh, as a wrestler, Luke is just like phenomenal. He's his record right now is like 24 and three, I think. 
and I'm just super proud of him and everything he's accomplished. Um, he's only had two years of wrestling in total, and he's abs he's just it's like insanely natural. He's insanely strong, probably the strongest guy on the team. I certainly hope that uh, he keeps his uh, walk with the Lord in the forefront of his mind, and that he never strays with him. And I just um, I'm hoping for good things for him in the future. He brings that energy, and um, honestly, he is the reason why we can pull through some of our matches. So, you know, he is a great team in overall, and I'm thankful that he's on the team this year. And I hope he can go all the way because he's probably the hardest worker in our room and he he deserves it. Okay, uh, Jaden and Luke, um, about eight or nine years ago, I had the privilege of being called to Dayton Christian Schools. And it's just been an absolute privilege to get to, to see you grow in the sport. Um, I can appreciate the sport because of people like you.